You there, Chris? Where's my bitches at? Yo. Where's my bitches? What's up, man? Oh, mate. I'm just fucking thinking about Easter and fucking the Easter bunny coming down the chimney and, and putting teeth in my stockings. Yeah, dude. <laughs> I thought it takes your teeth. <laughs> 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 You're gonna wear a mouth guard tonight, right? That's yeah, that's it, man. In England, man, what happens on. What happens, right, is we get Easter eggs put in, put in our mouth, right, by the Easter bunny who comes down the chimney with a Halloween bucket. That's what happens. Gotcha. Yeah, it's a non binary. Oh yeah, I did see that there was like I read some like Irish churches that I thought would have been super religious or even like saying no Christmas tree. Nah, like fuck man. Well, I guess that maybe that's an American. I never. I don't. Know. You know how do we all live in America. An American Christmas tree. Well, force a Christmas tree into a Buddhist temple man. through the windows man, like that. Have it, it's Christmas! You bastards! Fucking have it! Everyone around here is pretty nice. I had a couple people say, I had a nice lady say, I was doing like push ups and like yoga stretching. I was in like awkward position. This lady like stopped in her uh, electric wheelchair and like kind of flagged me down and like, said, Merry Christmas to me. It's kind of random, you know what I mean? Story,
Hello. Hey, guys, I'm pretty sure this is somewhere in Central America or South Northern, North, <laughs> the part of North America where they speak. I don't speak any Spanish, guys. So can one of you volunteer to do all translations? Like, can we get it? Okay. Thanks, man. Appreciate that. And I've never jumped out of an airplane before. Of you guys, this will be my first jump, too. No, no pressure. Have you guys jumped out before? No, it's not my first game, but usually I take the bus into the battleground. <laughs> <laughs> oh man I just started a round right now with these guys I'll quit out man you want to play alright yeah let's get Ed back here I th well he was going to play but he may have okay Okay. <laughs> I could. I'm. What? I get, it's like I'm getting sucked in further and further the more I get. Like, all right, I just. Quit. <laughs> it's the new map, so I, I don't even know anything anyway. All right. Yeah, I like. I. It's. To me, it's almost like a new game. I mean, it's the same game, but it's like pretty fresh take on it like a new almost new packet kind of thing i like the i like the start menu it's like a action movie kind of thing going on it where <laughs> everybody stands by the dazia <laughs> in the, the, the <laughs> church <laughs> all righty Oh, shit. So how's your, uh, forget, happy, or, or merry, happy Christmas Eve? <laughs> merry Christmas, happy Christmas Eve. Oh shit, you're, yeah. going to, you're going to a Christmas Eve thing then for Christmas. Yeah, yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, okay, I was like, today's not Sunday, is it? Is it well, Sunday? it is Sunday. It is Sunday. Holy shit. <laughs> it, it, so it, it is. <laughs> oh my gosh, you're right. It is. I know it. I knew it. I did. I went to <laughs> walk my dog. I was super busy on the weekends and there were like tons of fire. I knew it was. I forgot it was Christmas Eve. I no, no Christmas worries. Yesterday. Yeah. Good. I like Christmas though. I like the whole. I like the. I pretend like I don't like it and stuff, but I think everybody the same. likes that. Yeah, I same, don't know how you do not like it. <laughs> yeah. yeah. It's like he's rebooting his computer. Apparently his computer was built in the 70s because I don't know why he's not back yet. Got to go through his wife. Got to reroute the uh, power cables through <laughs> the kitchen. It's probably not completing the. the <laughs> Apparently, I was gonna message him like, "Yo, you, you run out of punch cards over there."
Holy crap, Ed. <laughs> like, it, it, did you blow a vacuum tube? Is that uh, why it took so long? Mate, my missus is on a fucking wibbly wobbly, man. What can I tell you? Well, we wibbly wobbly. We wibbly wobbly yourself tomorrow, into man. the game. Yeah. Don't say that about your wife. Oh, we had to, we, <laughs> it's oh, one mate. thing about me having a wibbly wobbly. But <laughs> <laughs> well, this is this is some next level wibbly wobbly, man. Uh, I said, "Come on, I, I literally tomorrow. have time for one game." Lint Ed. in the fucking. Okay. Field. All right, I'll shut up. Let's get. Let's have a game. Literally, time for one He's game. Not interested in. In 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 the. I'm 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 not interested in your drive. The futility no. of my relationship issues, and I get it. Mm. Right. Not Dante interested in drive. Has, Dante has moved to Alaska for a fucking week or something. So I'm That's to awesome. Leave. He's out of state, apparently. Is he really in Alaska? Kind of far. Nah, I was just fucking being a dick. He's in the next state, I guess, I'm guessing. He might have gone out of Mexico. You guys just have family and Mexico stuff in Mexico. Mexico. State, is it? <laughs> well, it's it, in a I state. Mean... Put it in a state. Dude, Ed, I come from a time when Mexico was where when you were 16 years old in Southern California and you had white privilege, you go down there so your white privilege gets you even more. And it was safe and fun. Yeah, it cool gets you fucking abducted exciting. and held ransom. No, it wasn't. That was because of, Ed, it was because it, of, the, I watched it happen. It, it, it gets you to... It, well, the escalation of our drug war and everything, it got un, it got more and more not safe. It is like that now. You can't go down there and do that now. Unless you're on like, Pablo you know, Escobar's payroll, you were fucked. <laughs> well, not, not back then. Not not like when I, in the 90s and stuff. It wasn't, I mean, there was, dr there was right. drugs. I mean, look, drugs it, stuff, as, as, long, as long as you're not attached to both kidneys, Mexico's a safe place. <laughs> <laughs> no, dude, not for a girl, like not for a girl, but for a young man. You know what, lads? Wasn't, you know what, lads? Wasn't Europe? Good. Europe's under fucking siege at the moment with all this shit. Right? I'm sure you know you're very privy to the situation. But I'm fucking paranoid about taking my fucking family anywhere at the moment, man. And maybe I'm playing hey. into the hands of the powers that be that are orchestrating these events. I don't know. But Ed, Ed as long as you're not attached to both kidneys, fucked up area. Do you know Ed, France has actually got an app for their fucking smartphones to tell them where the migrants are kicking off? Ed, Ed, as it's long as you're not attached to both kidneys, Europe is a safe place. Yeah, I mean you've got a lot of room to breathe over there when you're in America. I've you've talked to the creators up. of the dome, oh, Ed, and the mass cleansing will take Ryan. place soon. <laughs> Ryan, you need to go and buy yourself some guns, man. Oh my gosh, that's the last thing I need to do, Ed. I think, I mean, if we really started fighting, I would tell you to buy me one for yourself and your family and for everyone Mate, else. if I could I don't buy a money. fucking <laughs> AR, I would buy an AR mutant, man. A fucking AR-15 oh, that shoots fucking... Seven six two rounds. I'm not Ed. I don't like when I feel. I I understand the need to appropriate arms and munitions and stuff when I feel it's appropriately necessary. For it's like always appropriate, just... mate. Well, maybe I, I don't know. The wise know. man in times of peace prepares for war. No. I mean, I do agree with that, but for me, that's not a thing that I'm not like that. I can fight. I can. Don't get me wrong, Ed, I can fight like that, but I feel most useful, most, like, do you under, I, I know that you do understand this, Ed, but I don't think you actively, well, it's because you're a big, you go, uh, you're, see, part of how I have such a different, I, like, I left myself, like, Ryan, so I have this weird thing where I can totally look at Ryan like it's not even me, like, I can cut right through myself like I'm not even there, where a lot of people, they don't look at themselves that truly because it would hurt their I It hurts, you know, like to really see like, man, I'm not this perfect. Uh, I'm not. I mean, you guys are, but not, you know what I mean? It hurts to look at yourself like that. But 
but Ed, you're like a big, you're like a big guy. You're like a strong guy. So like your idea of masculinity is going to come from that. So like you think that we know from your identity to be stronger or tougher, it gives you a gun or something. like for my identity, for how I'm built and how I function, some of my strength comes from being the gray man, from not having a gun, from being a pacifist, from leaving those options open. Now, am I going to let anyone come into my home or hurt my family or attack my country? I think you know better, Ed, <laughs> right? But that's how I feel about weapons. I'm not. I'm not anti-weapon. I'm not anti-defend yourself. I'm all. I'm totally defend yourself. You know what I mean? Like I. I. You might as well put Second Amendment on me. <laughs> I am the Second Amendment. I am the bare arm. I don't. I'm just. You get, does that make sense? We're going to play a game, right? Is that what you wanted to hear? Ed! That's too much. Don't know he's um, absent, unfortunately. He's our, he's our fucking keystone player, but we're going to have to make do without right? him, I'm afraid. Fucking hell. He's typing like a fucking epileptic. <laughs> Jesus. Fuck it. Someone's having a seizure again. Alright, that's gotta be Ryan, man. There's hey, no way you can watch. It's, uh, it's Chris. It's not Chris. Who is it? It's not me. It's you, you fucker. I would know if oh. I'm typing, Ed. I thank you for giving well, me that much credit. I'm inviting you. I'm inviting you. Ed. Fuck's sake! Why does this keep kicking me out? How come you get a star? Does it give you a star for being a party leader? Just because you lobby leader, I think. Alright, and. Basically, because I'm a star anyway. I know. I don't give yourself some more credit <laughs> yet. Come on, man. <laughs> I'm an empath, mate. Come on. Right. <laughs> Let's get fucking. Where's Clegger? Clegger's fucking. Off fucking saving the world somewhere, isn't he? Are, are you going to invite me now? I have several times. No, you didn't. Yes, with a bioluminescent haircut. All right, ready up, let's go. Uh, this is, I'm still quite fucking new to this, to be fair, but let's go. Dante is a fucking, we need Dante, you know. And Nick's just text me. All right, Chris, stop fucking spamming my phone, man. Phone's running out of memory, man. I've got loads of portals saved. <laughs> you, you're erasing all my, uh, all my midget porn <laughs> pages. Ed, did you see? Uh, did you did you get this winner winner chicken dinner shirt? Winner winner chicken dinner what? The the shirt. Check out my shirt. Oh, I've seen many. Um, Variations on the uh, PUBG shirt uh, merchandise, and a lot of them are very attractive to me. If no, no, get, if we could, if we could get no, one, like you know, I'm like talking when, about in oh, no, in game, head head in game. Oh no, no, not in game. No. Look, look at my shirt. I'm coming to you. Well, we're not going to make it. We're out of time. I'm right behind you, Ed. I will look. Ed, 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 I know that you're an empath, but I channeled it to another level where I tapped into the un, like the collective wisdom. So like what I am and how I think and how I operate. Like if you really want to know, I'm, Ed, a, I'm a Christmas empath, mate. 
Ed, you don't need to All right. ask me. I'm jumping Just now. Imagine, imagine the collective intelligence and what would that do? And that's what I would do. I, I'm not I mean, very what, mate? Just, just you know? use empathy to to guide yourself. You know, and once you've, you've guided yourself into a place of security, then use it to help others. Because it's all I can tell you. If you, yeah. if you want to save someone, save yourself first. Because you can't save any fucker without yourself being saved. Yeah. You know? Yeah. And that's not being that's not being a dickhead or anything. That's just yeah, like... I know. And that's where I'm at. And I'm doing... I'm, you know, I'm getting, I'm getting there. You are, mate. Babe. You're a good lad, man. We Oops. know you're a good lad. I mean, we wouldn't have we wouldn't have tolerated your abuse this long if we didn't know that. <laughs> Don't put that on me, Ricky Bobby. <laughs> We're all men here, all right. You volunteered for the recon corps, all right. It's all good, mate. Like I said, I'm empathetic to your situation, so that's why I'm still there. Well, if you right. gave me more truth, Ed, I wouldn't be. You realize too, our dynamic is part of. Me I haven't type. given you lies. I've just, I've just, I've just. I know, but you realize you though, truth. you do There's acknowledge. There's a difference between lies. There's a middle ground between lies and truth. I though. just want you to know that I will appreciate your friendship, but I also recognize there's a dynamic variant that's not normal. So when you tell me that I abuse you, that's kind of not the true statement. I was more. You call me? I you, want to know what you're doing. You know, you call me nasty things uh, and that. Uh, you know? That's not. That, I agree. That's not. If I was a dickhead, I would go. Or especially if I if I had ovaries, I'd be all over the place all night. But because I'm a man and I'm rational and I'm pragmatic, I will. I will agree that you're rational and pragmatic, but I don't know if that's because you're a man, Ed. <laughs> it's a general rule, isn't it? I mean, I don't know many women you've dropped your knob in, but you have a daughter mean. now. You have a daughter. Yeah, no, no. danger, danger, man. It shits me up. Yeah. Fucking shit myself having a daughter, man. I've got two lads, right? I've got a nine-year-old boy and two four-year-olds, boy and a girl. And uh, my boy, he's like, "You're a fuck, man." It's like, "Come on, lads, you want to live forever?" Sort of thing. But with the girl, it's like. <sighs> Fucking hell, man. You know, and she's yeah. good. That's okay. Girl. You, you, know, she's you, not, you she's only have to pay seventy-seven percent of attention to her. I know. If you do, yeah, I know where you're going. But when you've got a little, a little girl, <laughs> it, it's difficult. Man. Just kidding. You know, I know you are, man. I know, I know the score. But um, it's difficult when you have a little girl. It just changes the whole shit up, man. That's why I always said to my missus, man, I just want boys, just want boys, just want boys. Don't fucking stitch me up with a girl, because it's so fucking, so full of fucking pitfalls and fucking, you know, all the rest of it. But then, I had a girl, obviously it never changed for a million, a million years, but because, you know, it's daddy's princess and all that, but it's difficult, man, because, you know, she's going to get to a certain age and she's going to start being in bringing home big fucking big black men with turbines on and shit you know what I mean it's just like oh, fuck are they airplanes <laughs> I was trying to I was trying to do a joke there obviously uh it's in the West. but yeah no if she if she if she comes out with like fucking you know the leader of ISIS or something but um it's just difficult, you know, because you'll, you'll say to her, look, you shouldn't be with him, he's no good, he's just going to get you pregnant and dip, you're just going to end up one of them trying to trash fucking girls. That, you know, check for a look. Oh my gosh, it's scary. I'm going to get blown up. You know, but the more you tell them that, the more they want to do it. And then you can call it a bit of a paradigm, and then it's like, It's a difficult one, man. Girls are complicated. Girls are very complicated. Girls are? Yeah. 
It doesn't sound very complicated from your Mate, explanation. Mate, that's super complicated. <laughs> boys, man. Yeah. Boys go fuck all day long and you're like, wee, the lads, go on, you know, go and bang as many bitches as you can, sort of thing. Obviously not that, not on such a cruder level, but you're like, yeah, you know, you want to encourage them to get out there and do what you didn't do and all the rest of it. But with girls, it's... It's what you didn't do, it's what you don't know. You know, it's it's a world you aren't experienced in and you've got you know, your only default reaction to having a girl is super protective. Ed, do you understand that I don't abuse you? You genuinely don't know right from wrong like a child. And if I wanted to, I could strip everything from you that thing you think is you. Like right now, I, I, I could just eviscerate your fucking idea. Yeah, I know, mate. But, you know, we spoke about this and I'm married and I like you a lot. I more. know, but, but I don't you know. appreciate comments <laughs> I'm not ready where to speak I realize to you guys are like together. gathering intel, asking me questions about weapons on purpose. What? Do you, th what do you think I'm going to do to you what? when you get hot? How many questions have I asked you about better weapons? better watch yourself, bro. You're a nutter, you are. Is me fucking You digging don't deep. understand boundaries. Is me dude. bearing fucking You live on an island, and and I've been kind. I've been kind. I've been kind. I've been patient. Yeah. I've been considerate. You're I've been tolerant. <laughs> Christmas Eve. <laughs> You're about to have a wibbly wobbly, right? No. Give me, give me the heads Ed, up. Mate. We're, Ed, we're past that. <laughs> I fucking hope so. Stop talking madness, man. I'm just talking about my kids. Jesus Christ. Man. Uh, it's oh, I'm sorry. Is it makes you uncomfortable. Down. If it makes you uncomfortable for me to talk about my kids, just say, man. No, that's not what makes me uncomfortable. You know what makes me uncomfortable. Well, I know yeah. hedgehogs do. But I didn't know that until you told me. Because <laughs> honestly, I didn't... You know, you may have sp spoken about that hedgehog thing uh, living under the gun range in Afghanistan in the past, but I didn't, stuff doesn't... I didn't put two and two together when I mentioned the hedgehog the other night, mate, honestly. It doesn't... That's not what... Ed, um... What bothers me is the colour of your shoelaces when you talk uh, to me. Well, I need a Valcro, mate. Well, that's what it is, then. I'm allergic to Velcro. <laughs> well, you know what the, the real the real issue is, mate? You have got to be allergic to nothing, man. you just got to be, uh... just got to be my mate. And that's all I ask. Well, I'm your mate, Ed. But I'm that's also... That's all I ask, Roy. That's all I ask, man. I don't ask nothing well, else of you, mate. Ed, you got to respect me. Of course I do fucking respect you. Mate, if you can call me a cunt and tell me I don't no, serve to kids not, and I'm a no, shit and all this, I'm, and I can I come shouldn't, back the next day and talk to you like you never said that, then. I don't. That, I don't. No, that's not respect. No, well, that's that's that, manipulation. That's manipulation, dude. <laughs> fucking hell. You sound like my missus. <laughs> oh, well, she's our <laughs> lady, bro. <laughs> fucking <hell. laughs> <laughs> He's spastic. Yeah. Fuck off, right? You wanted me up there. I love you, Ed, but <laughs> this is real, man. No, reached... you ain't gonna me up, man. I'm as... Bro. Ed, as a species, we've reached a new level. You're my we... friend, I hang out with you, but, like, I just... Please appreciate that. Of course you know? I do. What the fuck you want about? Just, you know, well... I like I turtles. Like... Would I be inviting you to games constantly, even after you have a blowout? And I don't know finish? what the f holy shit, Ed. I'd just fucking blank you. I'd, I'd delete. Have I ever deleted you off anything? Have you I got, ever I got a book or anything? No. I'm in a big fight. I've never extradited your persona off any media. So come on, man. Fuck. I'm dead. Oh, Holy man. shit, there's... Zero, zero. There's, uh... Zero is down. Four, oh, I can hear noise, lads. Four. Four of them. Fuck, you know, this map's really complicated, isn't it? 
Uh, Yo, this map is you awesome. Can't, I just gotta get. I'm not in a place where I can have someone fucking with my head right now. I, I really have. Fucking important... head. I just wanna play a game with you, man. I ain't even going there. It's you going I there. I know. I know. Just relax. I ain't got nothing to hide, mate, honestly. I ain't fucking working for Putin or whatever the fuck. Ed, I'm not worried about. That's not what I'm worried about. What's I'm worried what about. I'm worried about that you are not in reality. <laughs> what that means for you, your family, your country, yeah, and everyone I'm you know, who you work for. Right. No, you're not. I'm not you're in, not, I'm not in, not in your, your reality, right? I'm you're not in, in your reality. You're in a perspective based on your culture and your raising, yeah, and I can, can fucking can isolate I, it down. Is it okay I if I stay there, Roy? I w would love for you. No. Well, <laughs> only if you start okay. speaking, you have to start it's speaking fantastic. Chinese. Then, if you speak <laughs> Chinese, you can stay there. Oh, well, I've just... changed the rules. If you're uh, English, you're British, the new nah, language is you gotta let Chinese. Me, you gotta let me. You gotta let sleeping dogs lie, mate. And everything is great. I'm just standing up now, and I, I feel out. like a lot of. Uh, I recognize when I look at foreign policy, I look at world leaders, I see the history, I see the influence I've already done, I see their foreign policies change, and I see my country and people in power manipulating me. Oh, and look, I see a look, bunch of people. It, Ed, management it's Jesus, change, bro. It's Jesus, Eve, man. I'm not fucking Jesus, but I'm in charge. And you tell the people that want to know, that's that's it. There's no other fucking... There's no... We can negotiate, we can communicate, oh, but otherwise, shut the fuck up, or get fucking dead. Uh, okay. You know what I mean? Alright, mate. Alright, alright. What are you getting for this Christmas, anyway? Ed, are you getting for <laughs> Ed, Ed, your life is in danger. Your kids' lives are in danger. Not from me, from your incompetence and inability to target ID, real threat, real danger. Those yeah, refugees, Chris. Ed, those refugees, Ed, you're the threat, not them. I marked blue. You live in reality. Do you want any of that, Chris? Uh, Mate, I'm, I'm chill full. out, Roy. Fuck, you know, I haven't spoken to you for a week, see. and you're just hotting me up, man. Ed, um, do you want me to target ID England? Uh, what do you think that England had to do with 9-11? What do you Chris, think? Chris, we gotta go. Ed, go. how fucking yeah, easy I'm, I'm do moving. you think it would be for me to throw you in the fucking fire, dude? The only reason I haven't said shit about England is because I'm waiting to see what cards you play. Mm -hmm. And if you play some dumb shit acting like you have a fucking say and you're not doing what the fuck I tell you... No, it's you're right, actually, because Poot, um... Trump has, has um, pledged to reinvestigate 9-11, hasn't he? Ed, he's he's going to look back into it. Is there anything keeping England in power? Is there anything we, we in reality? In, we haven't been in power since, what like, do you, hundreds What years. do you contribute to reality, Ed? Well, no. We what are you so afraid of from these refugees? Um, Why do these refugees scare you? Because you don't contribute jack and shit, Ed. I don't because you're know, fucking maybe, worthless. Uh, oh. They're a threat to your identity because you serve no fucking purpose. So naturally, they're in your space. Because it's your space because you serve no fucking purpose. You're a goddamn cancer. God, I can wait for it. No, no, no. All it is, mate, is we're a little tiny island, man. You're like a massive continent. No, Ed. And what it's happens science, is if you flood, if you flood a cunt, if you flood a small place, with enough refugees, it over, it, 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 choke, I help it chokes you. the national service, it chokes you the house. You need to stop acting system. like and then you people have... who live here get choked and lose, and then it creates um, it... creates a, a negative vibe, like a... You need to stop abusing God. Socialism, and that's how that's you understand, that. Ed? You need to stop abusing God. I am abusing. Fuck all, Every man. time you say that to me, you're trying to interject some stupid I shit on me. I trying to interject to anything. Your wife is a you smart is. lady, but this is bigger you never than, spoke like, to why, do you, why, do you, why do you start out a game asking me about guns and weapons? I and you're literally, you about any you're guns. leading and probing. You always fucking do this. Mm -mm. 
Yeah, Ed. I didn't ask you about any guns this time, did I? I never mentioned guns or nothing, right? I was just like happy to speak to you, man. I was happy that you were, you were still there, and you know you can have a nice Christmas. That's all I give a shit about, really. Fuck well, all that shit for, for ten minutes, nice yeah. Christmas, Ed. Well, have a nice Christmas, please, right? And if you're gonna have a wibbly wobbly and dip out, then just let me leave you with this thought. You know, I've, yeah. I've got, I've, I've built for you, just man. like your wife is having a wibbly wobbly, Ed. I'm yeah, like, uh, she, wibbly yeah, she's. Wobbly. It's all right. Just, I'll, just I'll... like hers is fake, Ed. <laughs> Mine's fake too, Ed. I'm not saying it's totally fake. It's, I'm not saying it's not legitimate. I'm just, you know, I'm just saying it's Ed, a thing. You are an important oh person, God. man. Why did you you're do this good... to me, man? Ed, you're a good guy, man. You, well, you let me be a good guy, your... Roy, and stop, stop fucking dragging me over the coals, man. What have I done? It's not me, motherfucker. I'm just showing you the fucking mirror, bro. I'm trying to. I'm, I mean, I know it's not you, nobody. Yeah, so, man. Look, just, I get can we it. not just play and talk about memes or something? Nobody <laughs> wants to see the mirror. I get it, man. I told you, <laughs> I don't want to see them. I know what I look like in the mirror, Christ. dude. Ed, when you look at my flesh, I literally. Here's something. For I've you. never if seen you your flesh, know, right? Well, well it's, it's gonna go chat and bait, like then that's the a different thing. But... shit. I fucking have this thing where I can't stop, it, like. I don't know what it. Oh. I mean, I know what it is. It's this imperfection thing, man. Oh, we're getting lit. We're getting lit. We're getting lit. It's. Oh, oh shit! I'm it's... down. I'm down. They're up here. East, east, east on the ridge line. My pat. Oh. Uh, I see you. Oh, yeah, I see you there. Man. I caught me. Fucking settings, man. What? If I need to check my fucking settings, man. Yep, they are <laughs> shooting at me now. Take a break. I need to check my settings. My prone's on a different fucking button. So, Fox. what is your goal for real? Oh, I don't know. Good life, not a long life, I guess. You don't take life serious. I don't get what. Well, I've I done it, and I. Ed. I've done it, right. You have kids. I don't. I've I mean, done what it. about your kids, though, Ed? I've done it, mate. What about them? I've done it. I've got three kids, mate. I will live on through my wife and kids, no matter what happens to me tomorrow. I mean, so as I'm dying on battleground after getting shot by a fucking Mini 14, as I bleed out and as you run up to me to try and revive me in that futile few seconds, my family will zip through my mind. And I'll die in peace, knowing that I will live on. That's cause... not what's gonna happen. <laughs> <laughs> I tried to paint that quite dramatic, didn't I? Um, no, but this is mm -hmm. three kids. When you die, you're not gonna s necessarily. I'll sum it up for you, Roy. I'll sum it up for you, mate. All right, good game, guys. I'm out.